Twas the end of fall semester, and all was quiet and still. Not a student was stirring, they had all left the hill. The red towels were folded in neat little stacks, and faculty and staff were resting their backs. The dogs were all nestled all snug in their beds, while visions of milk bones danced in their heads. And Jules with her popcorn and I in my cap had just settled in for a winter break nap. When out on Chestnut there arose such a clatter that I sprang from the couch to see what was the matter. I looked out the window and to my surprise, staring back at me, I saw two great big round eyes. With a mouth open wide and a furry round head, I knew in a moment that it must be Big Red. A broad happy face and a great big round belly that shook all around like a bow full of jelly. Dressed all in fur from the head to the feet. And from the looks of its belly, it was time to eat. Through the house, Red tiptoed, searching room to room. Eating gifts in my hat. And even the broom. Always chubby and plump, a right jolly old dear. With the joy in the spirit that is only found here. Red spoke not a word, but petted the pup. Then slipped out the door with a friendly thumbs up. The escape car was red with a driver like snow. Big Red had some help, wouldn't you know? And they held up a sign as they drove out of sight. Happy holidays from WKU and to all a good night.